You call them rhymes, I call it clearing out my mind. Was just a young boy staring out my blinds. Till I got free from my mama leash. Running loose through the streets like a straight dog in heat. And we looking for some freaks. Can you play? Pardon me. What's your name? Don't mistake me for no. You too, what's going on? No Limit Shine here. Bring out another story. I'm going to leave the other two stories in the description. If you haven't song yet, the first one was me making a rap about this girl in high school. And then the second one was when I got to, when I fought a girl in elementary school. So this one is going to be when I broke my hand in the eighth grade and I got to a fight with a dude this time. I ain't fight no girl this time. This was a dude this time. It's going to give you a little background of my middle school. I'm going to leave a description of me slap boxing in my middle school too. It's going to be funny. I had a big ass fucking dicky shirt on and shit. And that, that's not that. That's not the person I fought. That's just, just trying to give you like, they showing y'all how my school was. Like, it was just crazy. Like, we used to roast each other all the time. Like, we just nonstop roast. It, either we were slap boxing, throwing shit, or roasting each other. Like, just throwing papers, roasting, slap boxing, going crazy. Like, <laughs> niggas didn't do no work. None of that shit. Cause, and fucking eighth grade, and where I live at, all we had to do was pass math and English. And that was it. That's all you think you had to pass math and English. So, did, did just enough in math, did just enough in English, and I was good. But other than that, I used to just fuck around in all my other classes. All right, so this is how the fight came about. All right, so basically your homeroom, whoever was in your first period class, they, they like grouped you together. So whoever was in your first period class, you would have pretty much every single class with those group of dudes. So the group of people, we would be around each other like all the time because we had every single class together. And we were like probably like the worst group, like. I think everybody in our class fought besides maybe like two people. Every, yeah, everybody fought, like everybody fought. Like it was just like a natural thing. Like everybody just had to fight each other eventually. Somehow, some way, somebody getting roasted, somebody get hit too hard. You know, you know something gonna happen, man. We, you know, 13, 14, whatever. So shit happens. All right, but so this is how my fight happened. All right, so we, um, we coming out of, um. I forgot what class it was. I know, okay, so, I forgot what class I was coming out of, but the nigga I got to a fight with the day before, like we always play around with each other. He smacked me, not just playing around and he ran. Like that's how we, we used to do shit like that though. We hit each other and do shit like that. So he smacked me and ran. But the only people that I really saw was like the people that like, you know what I'm saying? That was in our group, like, I'm saying our classmates, like a lot of people really didn't see it. Like nobody mainly saw it. It was just us. A few people playing laughing and said, I'm like, all right, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you tomorrow. I was like, I was like, all right, I got you. So then the next day, cause he knows I was gonna end up smacking him eventually. So the next day, I think he was looking for me to to hit him or something. But I was like, I was like, man, I forgot all about that. Psych, I lied. I didn't forget about it. I'm gonna smack the shit out of you <laughs> when you least expect it. So he thought the shit was all cool. First period, second period, third period. He probably like, he probably thought like, oh yeah, he forgot about it by then. I know he, he, he <laughs> I'm about to smack the shit out of you. So we got out of technology class. We was going, we was on our way to science. So like before he like, um, all right. So technology class is all the way downstairs, and then you, it's like a hallway. And then you go up. And I think like, and then so when he went up the stairs, he came through when he was coming upstairs and shit, like I'm saying when he was about to on his way to science, I smacked the shit out of him like, like some crit like I smacked it like I smacked him hard as a bitch. I don't give a fuck. I don't think it sounded, I didn't hit him that hard, but it, it sounded kind of loud. Like, but when I smacked him, it was mad people around. So <laughs> you know how people be boosting in high school. Oh, bro, you gonna let him smack you like that? Oh, you bitch. You, it couldn't have been me. Man, he would have to see me. I'm like, you smacked me? You know what I'm saying? You smacked me yesterday. I got my head back. You can't say nothing. So then he was mad as a bitch. He embarrassed all the bitches laughing at him and shit. Everybody laughing. Bro, you know, they trying to, they want to see a fight. They like, bro, you gonna let him smack you like that? Yo, that's crazy. That shit was loud as a bitch, bro. Like, you know how everybody be boosting and shit. So he just looking stupid. The big ass, he had a big ass head. I got a big head too, but his head was like crazy. Like on some Jimmy Neutron shit. So he just like, he mad as a bitch. He thinking like, damn, man, shit. So, 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 so we on our way to science class and shit. I go to science class, everybody sit down. 
And I think everybody tell him like, yo, bro, you can't let him do that, bro, you a bitch. So he came up to me and shit on some, like I was sitting down and shit. So I'm sitting down, he like on the side of me and shit. So he like, yo, bro, I gotta get my head back. You can't just smack me like that. I gotta get my head back, bro, hell nah. I'm like, man, I was like, yo, you smacked me yesterday. I smacked you back, we even. That, that basically, I'm like, that's it. Don't let these, I say, don't let these niggas boost you up and shit. So that's why I'm telling him, like, yo, don't let these niggas boost you up. So, and then when I seen him balled up, and he balled up his fist. Like, you know what I'm saying? He balled up his fist. Like, he was like, he wanted to fight. Like, you could tell, like, he started shaking a little bit. And he balled up his fist. Like, I could tell he was about to hit me. So then I got up. I got up on some shit. I got up. And then I just, like, pushed him into the fucking wall. And then I just started hitting him and shit. Also, boop, boop, boop. I was just going crazy though, cause I don't, I don't like that. Like, fuck, you trying to fight me for, nigga? Like, fuck, you smacked me. I smacked you bad. You just got embarrassed, cause I smacked you around a whole bunch of people. It don't make a difference. I smacked you. You smacked me yesterday. Just playing around. I smacked you back. The fuck you get mad for? Like, the fuck? So yeah. So and so and so I got up, I got up quick as a bitch. So, cause when I, when I got up, he didn't swing. He should have swung, but he he probably just he probably thought I was gonna try to move away from. I don't know what he thought. I got up. Pushed him into the wall and I just I just blacked out. I started hitting him. Boom, 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 boom. I was hitting him and then somehow like I I, I tripped over a, I tripped over some shit and then I ended up like that. So then he had grabbed me, but he could have been punching me and doing all that, but he didn't he didn't did he just was just holding me. I don't know what he was doing. Like he was scared or something. Like he so he had me for a minute. And he, he could have just been punching me. That's what I would have did. He could have just been punching me or something. He could have thrown me to the ground or something. He didn't do nothing. He just, he was just sitting, we was just sitting there. And then once I broke off that shit, I threw him on the ground. And then I just started doing some UFC, like ground and pound type shit on his ass. Just boom, 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 boom. On some John Jones shit. Just, and then one time I, I hit him, I, hit, I think I said hit him in his face, I hit him like in his skull. And when I hit him, it landed like on my pinky right here. And that shit must have cracked. You know, when you're adrenaline going, you can't feel no shit like that. So I'm saying after the, somebody came and broke it up and shit, put us in separate offices. I went into the administrator office, he, you know what I'm saying? He asked what was gonna happen. I told him that he, he hit me before I got my head back, but I think he was embarrassed and shit that I did it in front of a lot of people. And it was just stupid. He just thought it was stupid that we fought over that. And then I just noticed my hands start shaking and shit. So I'm like, the fuck? He's like, you all right? What's the matter with your hand? So I'm looking at my hand and that shit just felt crazy. I'm like, yo, what the fuck? And that's, I'm like, this shit don't feel right. That shit just felt like out of place and shit. That shit was all fucked up. Yeah, it was stupid why we still, so, you know, they called our parents, you know, all that stupid shit. We both got five days out, out of school, out of school suspension. Both got five days. I didn't get in trouble or nothing. Mom came and picked me up. And then I had to go to the hospital and shit. I was there for hours. Like, I had to get the x-ray. Then I was in a wait. Then I had to wait there. I was waiting there for like three, four, five hours because it was mad people ahead of me and shit. It ended up being broke. So this shit, my whole shit, this whole shit was broke right here. Broken bone. My pinky still look fucked up. Like my pinky knuckle, like you can't you can't really see it as much as you can see it on this side. That shit that shit still kind of look fucked up. Like it's way like kind of over here. That shit fucked up. So I had to get this little cast shit, and the shit was like that. Like the cast covered up these two fingers. This shit like that, and then it was like that. And that's why I do a lot of shit with my left hand now, cause that shit was like that for like two and a half months. So I just started dribbling with my left hand. And I just started doing mad shit with my left hand. Like it was just weird. Like it made me kind of almost left-handed, but shit was like that and shit. So I had to fucking play the game like this and shit. Like <laughs> at that time, I had the original Xbox. At that time, I ain't, I ain't even had no 360. So I was on some crazy trying to play shit. I think I had like Blitz the League or some shit. I'm trying to play that shit. That shit was all uncomfortable and shit, all, all fucked up and shit. And it was funny because everybody, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, we used to roast each other and shit, and he had a big ass head. And the nigga, um, who said, I think it was Alfred. He was like, he like, he was like, your big ass head, I bet you was somebody, you'll probably break somebody. If somebody try to punch you, they'll probably break their hand. 
and that was weeks ago. Like we would just be joking around with him and shit. So it's funny that he said that the nigga Alfred said that as a joke, and it really happened. I really end up breaking my hand on this fucking big ass fucking head. So as we got, you know, what I'm saying from out of some from suspension, we came back to class and shit. We talked and shit like that. So we was cool after that. It was just like. It's, we just laughed at it like it was just stupid why we even fought over that. I understand. I understand why he wanted to fight me because that shit was kind of embarrassing. The way it, it didn't really hurt. I, I smacked him hard, but it it just sounded like crazy. Like I ain't hit it. I I hit him, but it wasn't like it, I'm saying it wasn't like crazy. Like I didn't do no. I I mean I cocked it back, but it wasn't like it just sounded crazy. It really wasn't. I didn't really hit him as hard like as it sounded. I'm saying the sound made it crazier than really what, what than what it was. The sound made it crazier than what it was and shit. So yeah, man. So we got back to school and then niggas was like, "See, man, look what you did to his head, big ass head." <laughs> so it'd be crazy. And then um, like every time we um. And then so then, then every time he like we start drilling each other and shit like that, niggas would be like, oh, I am shit. I be so uh, just like Sean did. <laughs> niggas would do that shit or when niggas like when, when I talk shit to somebody, they'd be like, man, I ain't I ain't asked you, man. You, you ain't gonna do that shit to me. Like, <laughs> you know how niggas be, so that shit was funny and shit, man. But that's a little quick story how I broke my hand. You know what I'm saying? Ground and pound and some some UFC shit. Fucking broke my fucking pinky and shit. <sighs> Big ass head and shit. Broke my fucking pinky bone and shit. This is a little funny story, man. I got I got some stories I'ma save. You know what I'm saying so this is what this this is the third one. So some stories I'm gonna save until my channel gets bigger. You know and so I don't wanna it's some I got some crazy, <laughs> like some funny shit. Um tell me which I tell me which which one y'all wanna see next. Me getting curved at my job by this girl or me almost getting jumped so what's one y'all want to see next and yeah, man I, and some stories i'm just gonna say it so if you say some something and it's like certain ones i'm gonna say for later so if i don't do it i'm gonna do it in the future just i just want to wait a little bit because i want to you know what i'm saying I, I, you know what i'm saying like i got some crazy ones i just don't want to say them yet you know but man no limit shine i'm out man hope y'all enjoyed the story more stories coming soon you know so i've been playing pro and we've been fucking losing like Man, that shit is fucking crazy. We be fucking taking hella L. We like on a fucking tour. Like, we like 35 and 11. <laughs> like, so, I don't know. I'm not, I don't really like losing this shit, but I just been uh, live streaming. So make sure you follow me on Twitch. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to leave the link in the description for my Twitch. I'm going to leave the link in the description for the first two story times. And I'm going to leave the link for the, um, when I was slap boxing in eighth grade. And and that slap boxing, that video is the same year I got to a fight and broke my hand. So I get to see how, you know what I'm saying, how crazy my middle school was, you know, in that little clip and all that. Videos coming soon. I got part coming up, pro am, all that. So just, you know what I'm saying, stay on tune, man. Stay tuned. Share the videos. Um, I believe on my 800 subs now. So, you know what I'm saying, that's good. Almost at a hundred, I mean, almost at a thousand subscribers and shit. So, the boy, you know, getting up there and shit, you know. No limit shine them out. Let's get it, man. Like, comment, subscribe, man.